out my business. Money. Okay. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Identity Booth. Y'all see we got a local celebrity in the building. Y'all already know what time it is if y'all see her on the screen. And if you don't know what time it is, it means you're not sub to the channel. So go ahead and do that. But without further ado, this is our favorite segment on the show. Make sure you got your cup ready. We got tea with Nafi. Nafi, what you sipping on today? This tea is like burning hot, like burning. Like getting burnt in the club. <laughs> burning. <laughs> yeah. He so, let it burn. Are you, you, let are it you burn. proud of yourself for that? Are you yeah, proud of yourself? <laughs> is that is that the hill you want to die on? Okay, okay. No shade though. I love Usher. Yeah. Um, but let's talk about him. So mm. thank you guys for joining me <laughs> on Tea with Nafi because this tea is piping hot. Don't let it burn you, literally. Um, but so if you don't know, Usher is establishing his residency in Vegas. So shout out to him because I think that's big. A lot of people do that. Go to Vegas, establish a residency. That's big. That's noble. However, Usher. Now, mind you, I'm going to talk about this because I didn't know before I had a conversation with Hero what the real scoop was. But as you all may or may not know, Usher went to a strip club and dropped bands. I mean, bands <laughs> from like money, money on like strippers, food, champagne, you name it, dropped bands. However, when at the end of the night, when it was time to sweep them bands, we all noticed a face that was turned the opposite way of mm. of which way the hundred who was on a hundred dollar bill who was that grant no I mean, on the hundred that's so franklin yeah so you know how franklin looked this way usher was looking this way so when you sweeping it on the floor you like <laughs> that's a pretty dark person in the middle so you <laughs> find out the strippers man like, no he did just play and usher left by this time right usher gone out the club he gone but he left his faces on the floor that's so they dope. were they that's were, hilarious so people were mad pissed the strippers were mad pissed because you know they was throwing it that night for him and all he threw was his faces so then i had a conversation and this is a tip to you shade room before you start and this is what i'm talking about people love to like sell gossip without getting all the facts straight maybe they need an effects on the shade room team because I swear they don't they don't they don't give you the full story. So mm. they pretty much clowned Usher and that's why I brought this tea because I wanted to clown him for doing some stuff like that. That's real cheap for him to do that, especially if he really didn't give them money, he used that fake money. But yeah. push come push like again I spoke to Hero earlier today and he told me that Usher already paid for all his expenses prior to the events happening in the strip club. Mm. That's the real man. So he already paid for it. So this was just a promo, again, because he's gonna he's, his residency is coming in Vegas. So this was just like a promo, right? Promo, like okay, get get ready, get ready to keep seeing this kind of stuff happening. Yeah. So again, people don't do the extra research like we do here on the identity booth. We give you straight facts. straight facts. No, none of that sugar coating. We read over here degrees. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, so so I was at first I was really upset with Usher. I was like, dang, like that's bogus. Like they probably was working really hard that night. Mm. But yeah, like I said, the push to come to shove, he already paid for everything. He probably gave an extra tip on top of that because he probably knew how these people were gonna feel. Imagine you being a busboy cleaning up all these bottles, <laughs> and, then, and then he slides you this little twenty dollar bill with a face on it that's, that's Usher. <laughs> and I'd be pissed. You know what I mean? I so yeah, so if shout I think, out to Usher. Yeah, I think it's funny. I think like the management should have definitely said something in the beginning, but yeah. it, the reaction in the story, the headline, it it, it it did its job. We're talking about it here on yeah. a show. Simul like it's it did its job. Um mm -hmm. but real quick, what's everyone's favorite Usher song? Uh mine's is Superstar. Oh man, see that's why we family. I love Superstar. That song is uh, it does something uh, to me. Uh, Superstar. Yeah. The way it come in. It, the way, exactly. Like, if I could sing, you wouldn't know me. So, <laughs> I would be somewhere else. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm still thinking about it. <clears throat> yeah. I but do yeah, like, so, I do I do like Climax, though. Climax is good. And then, what's the... Uh, well, I do like Burn, too. Burn was a great song until, like, the whole, you know... He was burning people? Out. <laughs> yeah. Allegedly. So, I don't know. Allegedly. Allegedly. We're not trying allegedly, to get sued. Because... 
I sure I'm on your side. I don't think it happened. I think these girls is chasing you for your money. But no, look, it wasn't, it wasn't a girl. It wasn't a girl though. Ooh, Allegedly. That's tea. That's, tea. <laughs> that, that's way too hot for me, Eric. Way too hot. My favorite song you keep is that the parody, yourself. My favorite song is the parody song from the Boondocks where the lawyer who uh, acts really, really uh disgruntled oh, sings yeah. the song <laughs> in the middle of the street while it rains. That's my favorite song. Um <laughs> You for whatever it's worth, to though, I. Good for you, Usher. Welcome to Las Vegas. Do you have a new song coming out recently? Yes. Do you want yes, to promote that song on this well, website, on this channel? We could really use it, but I want to give kudos I'm to dope. Nafi for being uh, this week's subscriber base because her videos have garnered us uh, three subs. Um, so a round of applause for Nafi's T. This is why the segment has not been canceled yet. Uh, yes. The moment. She becomes dead weight. We will leave her behind. And <laughs> don't cancel me. Happen, you cancel me. I'm telling like, your father. So share, you figure out subscribe. what you want to do. You hear me? Like I will, I will blank her out of existence. And I also, hero, I gotta shout out my ship. I gotta, I gotta shout out my ship, Lizzie G, because she said she wanted to jump on your podcast one day. So my ship, Lizzie G, is a big, big time Chicago artist, rapper. Um, she promotes. One thing about Lizzie is that she don't curse in her music, which is one, one reason True. why I really envy her. Because that's hard to do. I mean, it's easy now. You see rappers talking about drugs, money, females calling out their names. But Lizzie does it clean. And then she has a big fan base called the No Bully Zone. So Lizzie goes into high school. She talks about bullying. She does partnerships with Walgreens to get school supplies and stuff. So shout out to Lizzie G. She wants to definitely come on you all show um, to just, you know, shout out, you know, some things that she's Lizzie working on and get some more hey, people. Lizzie, you want to perform during the 24-hour uh, live stream? I, hey, I think she, I think she'll be down. Lizzie will be down. She's definitely a positive person. I, I envy her. She was my roommate in college, and we became sporty sisters. So definitely shout out to Lizzie G, and hopefully she'll be throw on the them, show. Throw soon. them diamond, throw them diamonds up. She throw the L's since we throw it for Lizzie, Lizzie G L's, but we can also throw it that. Ooh, ooh. Shout out to DF, DSFWMD. We just turned ten years in the in the bond. Uh, okay, Shout out to okay, us. Okay, uh, sorry. Relax, yeah, relax. Lizzie Jesus, G, sorry. Contact, <laughs> contact your people. She's clearly an advocate. Come on down. But uh, yeah. the endurance twenty four challenge. We're gonna run twenty four miles in twenty four hours. Uh, that's a lot of dead space. If you want to fill that space, send us your act and send your agent, and uh, we'll we'll obviously consider it and we'll probably put it on the screen because we don't have much else. Yeah, to put on. yeah. And, and and you spell thousand T H O U S A N D. And for the rest of this, you can find us on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, uh, TikTok, Instagram, all over the place. Uh, our links are right above our heads. ET Fax is there. Uh, the underscore identity underscore boot. I guess we should put Nafis up there. Uh, I'll snap, and now it's on the screen for you. But for all the time, we can catch the But it's so hard to find through the daily grind. We're working overtime. And I'm sleep deprived. Shorty on my line, and we feel some fights. Seems like every night, don't care who's wrong or right. I hope the end is like slow it down and we can catch the vibes. The vibes, the vibes.